We'll start with a Partridge Spider size 14, straight eye hook. I've got orange cobweb 6 aught. So we'll just attach this a little wee ways behind the eye. Whoops. Two or three turns, like so. We'll just hang that out of the way. So what we need now is a brown speckled partridge hackle. Now there are many ways and different techniques of tying this in. This is the way I do it. So we strip off those. I need a few more off there. Then we turn the hackle around and we put the hackle player on the tip like that. Now for this size 14 what I want is about five millimeter of hackle uh, that way. So we pull those both up like that. I'll put my, I'll just trim that down like so. Put my hackle plier back on there. Now what I want to do is strip off these on top. So we have this part of the hackle pointing towards us. Then what we do is we make one turn, keeping pressure on your tying thread, just pull the hackle through. Another turn to secure it and then we can go back here and we fold the hackle over. Then we take our tying thread and we keep tension on this part with your left hand and we push the thread into that with each turn. Doing this will slide your thread perfectly in neat touching turns along the whole hook shank. Now again there's many thoughts on this. A lot of people say the spider should end at the hook point to the body like that. I like to take it a little bit further. This is all up to you. So we go back to about there, then I'll take my scissors and I'll cut this off as close as I can get it. Then what I'll do is I'll spin my tying thread to give it a round profile because there is several ways you can do this as well. I'll make a couple of turns just over the end. Now you can follow touching turns all the way back to the front again to make it a, a flat silk body but I like to put a rib on it. We just go up over the body. Like so and then we go in front make a couple of turns take our hackle plier place it on the partridge hook uh, on the partridge feather pass it over on that side and we'll swap those around come up behind Secure the high cult stem with a couple of turns and then we can turn our vise again, cut that off as tight as you can. Whip finisher. Remove the tying thread, tiny drop of varnish, the same on that side. And then I'll just 
split the ankle fibers and the method of doing it this way you get a lovely distribution and a perfect curvature to the spider hackle and that's the finished partridge and orange spider if you enjoy the videos please like share subscribe and thanks for watching